The 2017 Cherry Blossom Festival print artist is Teresa Dawn Smith, or more commonly known as T. Smith. I wanted to do a print that represented the essence of cherry blossom, and I titled it Reflections. You can see the reflections of the water of love, beauty, and international friendship, because that was the phrase that Carolyn Creighton used 35 years ago to coin the Cherry Blossom Festival. So it's kind of a little bit in her honor as well. That is a real church in the distance. We have not been able to place or name the church. I have a picture of the church that I took probably sometime in the 1970s. Even my Sunday school class could not locate the church. And I couldn't remember that far back, but it's in the Macon area, and I honestly think it probably is no longer standing, but now it has a final resting place, so to speak. The issue two is our porcelain artist, and it's Macon's very own Sterling Everett. This is a round building at Central City Park, and with its restoration, I tried to show uh, just what a beautiful building it is with its copper roof. Um, during the restoration, the windows were duplicated and put back in. With all of the work going on in the park, we thought it would be nice if it could be the plate. People's favorites, Mark Ballard. A Macon native and is well known as an artist, designer, chef, writer, television, and internet personality who's also been involved with the festival in many ways since its beginning. Well, my inspiration, I just went back to one of the mottos the festival's always had, which is love, beauty, and international friendship. I did the heart, of course, the center of the cherry blossom, and this is the 35th anniversary. So I found it in the middle. On one of the leaves at the bottom, I put the year it started in 1982, and then the at the top going forward, so we're kind of doing a little revamping and going to the next, next phase of Cherry Blossom.